Hi everyone, welcome back to Guy Girls Corner. Guy Bache. Wanna? Thank you so much for coming back to watch our videos. If you're a new subscriber, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell button. That way you can get our notifications. Mm -hmm. You can you'll be the first to know when we post videos. If you're an old subscriber, thank you, thank you, thank you very much. Um, to get into this video, we're just gonna get into it. Yeah. So I wanna know, does a girl need to share her body count with a, a guy? Is it necessary? Actually, I w yeah, like, do you need to? And for those who don't know what body count is, basically, do you need to share the amount of people you've been with, with oh, that's your new cool. partner? As in, yeah. as in sexually. Do you, do you guys think it's necessary for a girl to share? Or do you think a guy needs to share? I don't think it's not necessary because aren't you, you're not supposed to take your past into your future. Good point. So why? I also I... think it's, it's it's not important. He's not going to forgive you. He's not going to change anything. Yes, it's already done. The only person you should do that to is God, so He can forgive you. Yeah, but how does that come about though? Is it like let's say we're sitting out eating, and then you ask me, and then there no, are some no. facts no. that okay. acts. You, no, but you know how like when you're in a relationship, sometimes you talk about like the people you like, oh, I dated blah, 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 I dated blah, blah, blah. So it's casually, for some people, it comes out. Like, <laughs> it would never come out. That's I, what I'm saying. No. no, for some people, it comes yeah. out. And then some people, like, uh, when they ask the question, you can divert and you choose not to answer it, right? And some people, too, when they answer, they want to be honest. Okay. I feel like in today's generation, um, it's okay. Actually, I think for generations past, it's okay for a man to have a lot of body count. But when a woman has a lot of body count, it's like she's a hoe. Yeah. That's Are you the man, as you're with other women, what were you thinking? Think about it. If you, Let's say a guy, you're with five women, right? And you're thinking, if you, you count, I'm with one, two, three, four, five. Every time you're with another woman, don't you remember, hey, am I the only person she's with? Mm -hmm. Or what if she's also like... But look, count? there are some men who like sleep around but never want to marry a woman and who's not a... Yeah, yeah, there are some men like that. Yeah. Which is really sad and really disturbing because I'm like, well, as you slept with that girl, is she now... Somebody else yeah, has to marry but that is not exactly. stupid. They never get wet virgins. Yeah. They struggle. They never do. Because I watched like... Yeah, I maybe it might be BuzzFeed or not. I can't remember, but like they did like a body count thing, and I mean some of the ladies had like sixty body counts. Mm -hmm. There was a guy who had like one thousand ninety oh, yeah. body counts, yeah. and it was like, is he like old? No, no. he's a young guy. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, how is that even normal? You slept with one hundred like, uh, yeah, intense of people like like a thousand people mm -hmm. like it's not normal and one of the girls i think she said oh like there was a time like when she was in college she would be like hey like i'm okay. trying to sleep with like every guy on my floor oh, you want to go like hang out and then like that's how she had a lot of body why count. why was that a thing for her i don't know i it's feel like this is are spiritual and demonic it's spiritual <laughs> and demonic and people are not being taught they just they think they're having fun yeah like the well let me tell you guys this story there is a couple they went through all the process, they love each other. And one time, the woman accidentally said, Oh, I did one abortion. And so the guy divorced. <laughs> Wait, wow. seriously. So, so that's why you should let your past yes, be in, in the past. past. Because, because you don't know how they'll like, take it. When I look at me and my journey of life and what I've been through, if I'm counting, automatically, now that is like the thousands, like what we talk about. You don't need that. Yeah. But automatically, yeah, many, many are mental, many, yeah, it hurt them. Yeah. And they yeah. can't let go. Yeah. But the, my thing is, you, you're not going to forgive me and you're not going to fix the past. Yeah. No. But what is no, there to my forgive and what is there to fix? No, I mean. Also, what I don't understand is, okay, why are you in pain? I don't understand. Why are you, why are you in your feelings in the first place? I, I, I'm trying to figure like this, out. This marriage that got... Um, they have to go through counsel. I think at the end of the day, the guy couldn't forgive. So they were struggling with pregnancy. Oh. And then the girl said, but so, that baby oh. wouldn't have been his. No, but, but, then, no, he but then he felt she, like maybe she she because, because of her. Of that, that's so why. she felt because of that. Me, probably it's not because of her. It's probably his sperm. Uh, what do you have to no say? You're quiet. Yeah, I don't think I should say. You should, you should even say anything about, about your past. If uh. you, and if you're gonna ask 
somebody else about their body count is okay for me to also ask you this yeah but, but the ones who are they are not honest no, no. Steve harvey said mm -hmm. no matter how many people you've been with mm -hmm. if any man asks you especially a woman mm -hmm. about your body count you've mm -hmm. been with three people period period and if you've, been, if you've not so if you've been with one person if you've been with one person one. fine but he you said if you, no he said if you've been with more than three people just you've been three. with three people that's your body count period oh, there's no, no need to tell the person see he said for a lot of men when you start going on the other finger it starts to look like 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 if you can count on one hand, it's fine. When you start going on the other yeah, hand, I, it's like, oh. Okay, I still, uh, my whole thing is, I still don't understand why it should be a problem. That's the thing. Some it. people just want to okay. know. No, but why kind of should that, okay. Some people feel like they can pick Wait, who you are. It's, it's always the men that have the problem. You know how you can yeah. have a husband who can cheat, mm -hmm. but you cannot cheat. Say so. Want, so far, no. no. No, that's how that's that's Isn't it the norm? Yeah, because sure. women cheat emotionally. Yeah. Men cheat physically. <laughs> Oh, I watched this um, a guy. He said, "See, every time a woman cheat, right? Before you know it, it's that guy who you always know." <laughs> so the, the guy who was her friend, yeah, her so brother. He said, That's why it hurt a lot because women's one is somebody you always know. It's like, somebody always, they have like, an emotional yeah, connection. They probably didn't introduce you to the person. It might be your kid's said, godfather. <laughs> that guy will do it somewhere you will not know. So like, with no, women, not all of them. Some of them do get your girlfriends, your best friends. And do it with them. Yeah, but see, for some men, I feel like cheating is like an ego thing. Like, it is you know? ego for And them. then also, actually, some people are prideful to say, like, for men, mm -hmm. I've had a lot of body yeah. count. Like, I've had blah, blah, blah. Like, I've had like 20 people. Because spiritually, if they know they're kind of so tired, they don't know. And, like, switching. The, the, way, the way you are saying why is interesting. I think, I think for people are mindful. Tomorrow, the way yeah. you people were raised, not how everybody was raised. Mokoye, neighbor, where they're mommy, single mother. And then he and Sarah, and they were showing. So he also has to prove. He grew up with the notion that the more women you sleep with, then the tougher or the guy yeah, you, you are. You can be with twenty women, and that person you are with, you're not even doing a good job. I'm sorry, but <laughs> no, that's why I don't understand. Because at the end of the day, it, it comes with. <laughs> So if the person you're with is doing a great job, I'm out. It's body count like matter. Like if you tell me, oh, this guy has ten body counts, and meanwhile he's with me, I've never had orgasm, nothing. Yeah, which means the ten. That's no practice, no real. So what Chris is saying is, if you're gonna have a large body count and come question, yeah. your skills needs to be great because you should have learned top -notch. something from. Yeah, by the time you get there, you should be training men. So it should be an education. Be you should do it for a purpose. So, like some people, okay. Some people experimented at a certain phase in their in life, life. Yeah. hence a lot of their body mm -hmm. count. Um, and I, what I've noticed is a lot of college students tend to experiment mm -hmm. in their college years. Also, I've found that, like, you know, after graduation, sometimes when you are getting to that phase where you want to get married, there's like the dating. The dating phase, you are dating and blah, blah, blah. Mm -hmm. And then, like, you know, you're getting a lot of body count. That doesn't mean you're a hoe or like you're sleeping around. Mm -hmm. But, and like Prisa said, certain people were also not doing it to like perfect their skills or like you know up notch their skills they were it, it was just like trying to find the one and there were a couple of mistakes that happened yeah there were some people too who stripped to make money to pay for education hence their body count mm -hmm. some people prostitution to get their body count some people sugar babies or you know to sugar get their body count so it, it depends but, but some people it could be bad the fun of it yes yeah. so. but i don't think you should share but either way, i don't, I don't think, think it's anybody's important business. in any relationship yeah. Whether he tell me, you, if you tell me, I'll be like, oh, nice, but I'm not going to no, tell no. you. Yeah, <laughs> you know, so right young people. Yeah, I didn't know, we, um, Steve said we should say three. He said, yeah, he said if you've been with more I'll than three, three. Yeah, you should say I'm not a virgin <laughs> one before you met me. Take it like that. Oh, oh no, no, because, because I, no, because, um, that actually two kids. Actually, <laughs> Actually, I'm saying that about. comes to the notion with you don't have to sleep with a person to break your virginity. Mm -hmm. So if you are telling the guy it's one mm -hmm. and he's confused, you need to tell go do science or read and something. Yeah, you know because no. so many things you can ride a bike, you can break like so many things can break a woman's virginity and not just somebody enter through you. So yeah, if you ask me if I'm a virgin or something, I'll ask you what are you looking for a virgin or are you looking for a woman to date with? 
I'm not gonna tell well, you what They don't usually ask about that. You well, no, but, but that one too, I can say this. Everyone, every man or woman is entitled to who they want to marry, mm -hmm. right? If to you it's important for someone to be a virgin, that's for you to find. Mm -hmm. You're gonna say, and he has a right to ask you that. That one he can ask you if he wants to. If he says he, that's his business. Yeah, if you want to lie, lie, you can also lie. How are you gonna know? He's never gonna know. Exactly. But the body count one. If he asks you, you don't even need to retaliate. You just say, oh, it's between me and my God. That's oh. yeah. the only See, can yeah, the funny thing with today's uh, is if you say it's between me and my God, then then now they they can, wow, you, you gotta lie. That's why you don't. No, but my question is, my question is, why should why should anyone? First of all. No. And women sleeping with another man or a man sleeping with another woman, they don't need you to forgive them for what? What did they? The thing is, see, the I watch, I watch this, I watch this man. video. The guy was oh, the day. Sorry, you know what I meant. People having sexual partners do not need to have to explain who their sexual partners are. See, I watched a video about like a young guy. He was like on the streets asking the guy. He asked like they were a couple. And he asked, like, what's your body count? The guy said three. He asked the girl, what's your body count? She said, I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> nah. <laughs> and then the boy's fist just like dropped. <laughs> and it was like, he was all of a sudden, like, not interested in the relationship anymore. I'm like, my man's. So you got three, and she got nine. She's she's like, no, his is the ego. Like, yeah, no, oh, no, his is egotistical. Ego because she's been with more people than him. His is egotistical. <laughs> For most men, it is. Yeah, like, uh, most of them, men yeah, men. yeah. Why does it matter? It's just like you. Um, some of the guys can date their friend, but they can't let their friend date their sister. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> they are yeah, but then they won't date their friend sister either. No, they some won't. of them people are. like that. They got like strong, some. Some people like, are psycho. Okay, but first of all, if you, and this is a whole other topic on its own as you're talking, because if you don't want somebody to date like your brother, you know the person's character. That's why you're fighting against it, cause. I remember in high school, there was this girl, and I'm not going to mention names because, you know, we growing and people will be seeing this. <laughs> but she liked, it wasn't even like she liked the brother, but she had started talking to the other girl's brother. And I'll tell you guys who the person's offline. And uh, the girl literally was fighting with her. They were fighting on the bus. And it was like, you can't talk to my... Hi, everyone. Welcome. We are back. Sorry. Sir, we have a business thing. <laughs> yes, those of you who are not contacting us about sponsorships and whatnot, our, our and maybe I do. Are, we're not doing a due diligence. We only did the one. Below. I do. Which one? I've yeah. been doing it for all the videos now. Really? I do oh. bid for business inquiries. Email oh. Gun Girls Corner. Oh, we also need to put oh. in, in the comments. It should okay. be a comment and pin. That way, people like other people in the what comments. Is the comment? oh, yeah. I was going to say, what is the comment? You put in the comments. Like, oh, the oh, oh, so that comment will always be seen. Like, pin, like, what are you talking about? She's clear off my weekend. You can never know. You can never know. You can never know. Friday is a two. Okay, okay. Then let me say, I guess, yeah, I'm off for one week. People, don't contact me about this. Hi everyone, we are back. Sorry, we had a little um, technical difficulty, yes. but we're back. Switch of location. Yes, we're just going to end off this video. Um, I think what the guy girls were saying in unison was you do not need to share your um, body count. Can't care, boko, boko. Yes, they they have it. it's not their business. All you need to do is teach them what you learned, the it's, position. It's, yes, it's very but do you guys want me to finish my story? Yeah, yeah. it was kind of So the girl yes, wanted uh, this one girl they were best friends, like me and Lady are best friends, right? Mm -hmm. And then uh, Lady wants to date my brother, mm -hmm. right? But I know Lady, like, you know, her body count, all the kind of people she's been with. So then or I got so mad, or her character, her behavior. So I got so mad at her, and I was like, you can't, no, you can't date my brother. And I'm telling you, these girls were fighting on the school bus and all kinds of stuff. Because, and I, I remember going to one, and I was like, what's the big deal? Like, that's your best friend. And she's like, yeah, exactly, the more reason why. <laughs> I she said, can't yeah. date my brother and i'm like why like and she was like because i know the type of person she is plus she also knew her body count and also honestly there's no need to be sharing your body counts with your um best okay. friend nope. because when no, you guys fight and don't don't share. no yeah. listen to what she told you i know her she yeah. see her do them yeah. anyway she see it yeah. Say, yeah and I'm, i think she did well because it actually she knows broke her relationship yeah. okay this happened to me too <laughs> 
in middle school. Um, <laughs> I'm a body count. <laughs> no, no, no. We're, 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 we're in middle school. No. Yeah, this girl, she said she likes my brother. And she said that I'm too bossy over him and he's going to pick her. I just looked at her and I laughed. I said, okay, just watch. <laughs> And so she never spoke to me again. I think you did that to the girl like Great American too. You, you did. Which yeah, one? I was not there, but you I remember did. you guys and Princess had shared this story to me. There was a girl who likes King, and you told her, My brother would never date you. <laughs> Beware. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I did. Actually, I she did. Actually, no, no, because I, remember, if you know King, he's very nice to people. Yes. She was actually upset with him. He doesn't know how because to tell these like, girls. You need to let her know. Like, she needs to know that you're not going to date her. I'm like, oh, you know what he's The girl who got pregnant not long after, like, talking to my brother, I said, you see the crap she would have put you in? You would have been somebody. <laughs> and then the people would come looking like nice. I said, <laughs> yeah. But then they would have said, you need to adopt the baby. <laughs> like, you know? But yeah, anyways, just. So Actually, <laughs> he would have out of pity for him. <laughs> he would have. He would have said, so he we need help to help with <laughs> Anyways, so yes, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell button. Yep, um, yep, if you're a new yep, subscriber, yep. Welcome. Welcome, 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 welcome. As Queen likes to say, hit the Gonti power. Kokomoti power. Gonti, eh? The Kokomoti. The thumbs up. And like it. So sponsors, sponsors, sponsors. We're waiting for your call. Our head is available. Yeah. Our body is available. Whatever you do. Uh, uh, Not in that sense. Wait. To add us to your we body count. No, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> if you are a fashion designer, a fashion designer, a beauty oh, whatever. A photographer. <laughs> like, seriously. You guys. Oh, you, 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 you. <laughs> Oh yeah, one of these days I want to wear some of like my things I saw in Ghana to put Irene's business out there. Yeah, you should. Yeah. yeah, I have yeah. a whole closet full of her stuff. Well, anyways, on that note, now girls are out. out.